Hi BBC, this is Andy. I love you, but can we please drop the swingometer? You used the swingometer for just about every seat that was declared last night, and really, the numbers are good, but look at those bars, they all kind of look the same. Let's have a look at these four. Four very different numbers, but the bars are about the same length. In fact, I tried to decode the scale of your swingometer using these three values. Let's look at the first one. This is 2.2%, which seems to be about here. So we'll put that on here, on the main one here. Okay, swingometer number two, that value is 10%, which looks like it's about here on the swingometer. Okay, we'll move that to here. Swingometer number three, that one is 13%. Uh, that looks like it's about here, which is really close to 10. And finally, this big one itself is 18%. Well, where does that go? That's here. So you've got loads of space for the first 10%, then everything is squeezed into that second bar. And what is the top? Is it 20%? Is it 25%? I don't know. And what if the swing was 30% or 25%? Would it kind of break the gauge completely and go over the top into a different segment? I don't know. So please... Can we drop the swingometer? Thank you.